Surah al-Baqarah, the cow. In the name of Allah the most merciful and most gracious. Allah is the wali, protector or guardian, of those who believe. He brings them out from darkness into light. But as for those who disbelieve, their aliyah, supporters and helpers, are tag hut, false deities and false leaders, etc., they bring them out from light into darkness. Those are the dwellers of the fire, and they will abide therein forever. Have you not looked at him who disputed with Abraham, Abraham about his Lord Allah, because Allah had given him the kingdom? When Ibrahim Abraham said unto him, My Lord Allah, is he who gives life and causes death? He said, I give life and cause death. Ibrahim Abraham said, Verily, Allah causes the sun to rise from the east, then cause it you to rise from the west. So the disbeliever was utterly defeated. And Allah guides not the people, who are Zalaman, wrongdoers, etc. Or like the one who passed by a town and it had tumbled over its roofs. He said, Oh! How will Allah ever bring it to life after its death? So Allah caused him to die for a hundred years, then raised him up, again. He said, How long did you remain, dead? He, the man, uh, said, Perhaps, I remained, dead, a day or part of a day. He said, Nay, you have remained, dead, for a hundred years, look at your food and your drink, they show no change, and look at your donkey. And thus we have made of you a sign for the people. Look at the bones, how we bring them together and clothe them with flesh. When this was clearly shown to him, he said, I know, now, that Allah is able to do all things. And, uh, remember, when Ibrahim Abraham said, My Lord, show me how you give life to the dead. He, Allah, said, Do you not believe? He, Ibrahim Abraham, said, Yes, I believe, but to be stronger in faith. He said, Take four birds, then cause them to incline towards you, then slaughter them, cut them into pieces, and then put a portion of them on every hill, and call them, they will come to you in haste. And know that Allah is Almighty, all-wise. The likeness of those who spend their wealth in the way of Allah, is as the likeness of a grain, of corn, it grows seven ears, and each ear has a hundred grains. Allah gives manifold increase to whom he pleases. And Allah is all-sufficient for his creatures' needs, all-knower. Those who spend their wealth in the cause of Allah, and do not follow up their gifts with reminders of their generosity or with injury, their reward is with their Lord. On them shall be no fear, nor shall they grieve. Kind words and forgiving of faults are better than sadaqah, charity, followed by injury. And Allah is rich, free of all wants, and he is most forbearing.